Hello everybody, welcome back to Cook with Zunsa. Today we are growing sprouts. Sprouts carry essential vitamins, minerals, fiber and are a great source of antioxidant. Sprout, we can grow it at home also. So today we are grow gonna grow mung bean sprouts. So let's do it. To grow sprouts at home, we're gonna need first one bowl and I'm gonna add around two handfuls of mug bean inside. Uh, you can add more depending on how many sprouts you want to make. I wanted less sprouts, so I added around two handfuls of mug bean. see the seed is broken so we must discard this also and check nicely the mug beans after checking nicely we must wash this mug beans nicely take out any dirt or the sand of this mug beans so we must wash it very nicely and then throw the water after throwing the water we must add another water we are gonna add around enough water just to cover the beans and then we are gonna cover this with one plate and leave for three to four hours hours of soaking is already double sized you can see the seeds are already grown and some of them are already growing the sprout so it's ready to start making the next process now we're gonna need one big container and one towel cloth so we have to wet now this cloth nicely very nicely wet it and then we're gonna squeeze all the water from this cloth we're gonna wet nicely this cloth and then we're gonna squeeze nicely the water because this towel cloth mustn't be like uh, dripping water but must be enough wet After wetting this cloth, we're gonna take back the container and we're gonna add nicely to cover nicely the container this wet towel. After adding the towel, we're gonna add some more water and we're gonna discard after that the water. Now it's time to add our mug beans. Now we're gonna take our soaked mug beans and we're gonna cover nicely the towel with all the seeds. This process of growing sprouts takes around 2 to 5 days depending on the weather that you are in my country is winter time so the weather is cold so it took me around five days to grow the sprouts but if you are in summer it takes way less time so after adding all the seeds I'm gonna add now one normal 
a cloth to cover this beans and we have to cover this beans so nicely mustn't see any beans from the container you cannot see like I cover this very nicely and then we're gonna add one plastic one plastic bag to cover this container when you finish cover this with the plastic we have to keep this in a warm place in your house like not in contact with the sun but in a warm place after around two days i came to check my sprouts and let's open this i open and it start growing the sprouts are growing nicely as you can see one of them is already like half grown some people prefer like this to eat like this but I want my sprouts to be way bigger so now let's cover this and wait for two more days after around five days of waiting my sprouts are done so let me uncover now the plastic and I'm gonna uncover now the cloth the cloth already got wet because the the sprouts left that water and it's ready let me take out it's already sticking in the cloth and it's all ready to eat it's so fresh and we can make a salad with this one we can make a Chinese noodles, we can make many things with sprouts. Sprouts are very healthy. And growing sprouts at home, it is much cheaper than if you buy in a supermarket. So let's take out the sprouts from the cloth. You can you can see it's sticking in the cloth and then it's ready. You can make any dish, any salad dish with this. It's so nice and healthy. Don't forget before you eat this you must always wash it and then you can cook. As you can see in my hands I took out some of them and how they have grown they have grown so beautifully and I got a full bowl of sprouts thank you so much for watching this video hope you like this video if you like this video please don't forget to like comment and subscribe to my channel And if you want more videos of growing sprouts, please let me know in the comment section. Thank you so much. See you in the next video.